Hello and welcome back. So in this video we are going to do our lab 34 that is setting up a VPN server with Windows Server 2016. If you want to continue using your machine, here are the instructions. And here are the rest of them. All right, so let's get this get this started. So we're gonna create a VPN server, and for that, server manager. Nope. Uh, resizing. All right, so where is the server manager? right there add roles and feature yeah it's been a while it's asking to click three times so selection all right so these are the server roles now we're going to find the VPN and I wonder it's not here so it means it's something else let's read remote access roles and remote access oh. once you click it you can see that there was a bar so it get go over and fetch those features and it's not remote desktop services just the remote access click next three times I feel like it's being uh, we're being rushed so role services VPN right there Again, click thrice. We are at the confirmation. We click install. So once the setting is done, like here, then we are supposed to click uh, open the getting started wizard. I'm gonna pause the video here. It feels, seems like it's gonna take a while. All right, so we can see installation succeeded. It took about maybe a couple of minutes. We're gonna click close. Getting started wizard link. I think we missed it. Getting started wizard should be somewhere here we can find. remote access let's go there start from there getting started come on all right so it says configuration required so oh remote link right there open the getting starting wizard is it here as well no uh, did I miss the link as well right there Clicking It's not responding interesting
I'm gonna pause the video here and figure out the why this link is not opening up my apologies it's in the back it's not a Windows uh, environment so are they grouped here server manager but whatever remote access window following step remote access step click deploy both direct access and VPN deploy both direct access and VPN right there so basically when you click that uh, link it open up in the wind back side but since it's not an actual window it's you certified pun intended so I did not uh, like give you that orange hue that play something open up in the background all right so let's go at the verify the behind an edge device with a single network adopter is selected click next you certify dot live labs is type and type the public name around by clients to connect to the remote access server box yes it is oh so you have to set these things up that's one more thing so it's not like you can set it up on your you have to do this step as well so basically what this is it's an address and I believe it's for the radius all right click finish and it's doing its thing it says wait one to two minutes we're gonna pause the video here all right so I want to say it took maybe a minute uh, of light successfully we can close it You will observe the remote access dashboard window management console window and just like classic you certify we just install a component that's it no explanation what this all is maybe it's not in the scope but still it you know you feel um, like something's missing but it is what it is if it gets me the credit here it is all right so i hope this video has helped you if it has please rate comment subscribe and share and i see you in the next one